Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Baishia's Chinese language learning program. Last time we talked about a, a Chinese tongue twister that can let us to practice how to pronounce the Chinese pinyin in and in. Today we will talk about Chinese plural. We all know that in English, the plural can be formed by adding s or changing some letters to the singular. But in Chinese, we have to add some words to the end of the singular to express plural meanings. Uh, okay, for example, uh, I think we have already talked about it in our earlier uh, lessons. Um, for example, 你, this is a singular, 你们 is a plural, okay? But in English, they are all the same. 你, 你们, 我 is a singular, and the plural will be 我们, you know, we add 们. behind the singular uh, to express the plural meaning. Another example is ta, this is a um, uh, man, ta, this is a woman, ta, okay, ta or ta men, ta, ta men, ta is a singular, ta men is um, the plural, so we add men. Another example, 朋友, the singular, 朋友们, this is a plural, okay, next is 这个人 is a singular, 这个人 is more than one person will say 这些人, so we change 个 to 些, so it's just the matter word change, 这个人, 这些人, okay, 那个人, 那些人, 些表, uh, is, um, means um, several or many, uh, you know, things. 那个人, 那些人, 一个人, is a singular, one person. 好多人, you can see 好多人, many people. Because if you don't know, uh, Exactly how many people there can say how do or if you know you don't want to, to see the exact number you also can say how do or you can say Zhenmen many people Zhenmen Okay in some cases we just need to add numbers and the mirror words to expect plural. We we talked about Chinese mirror words in our previous class so we will see some example for um, you know uh, some plural uh, form, just a number plus the matter words and plus the name. Okay. 两只袜子两只袜子 Did you see we add number, matter words and the name? So this is a plural. 两只袜子 or 鞋子, or 手套. Another example, 一滴水, 一滴 is one drop, is singular. 三滴水, see number, matter word, in the name. 三滴水, three drops of water. 三滴水. Okay, uh, this is uh, a very easy uh, lesson today, so I hope um, this lesson uh, still will be uh, very helpful for you, you know, to um, use the Chinese plural to express some, uh, you know, Chinese meanings. 谢谢,